You know what this is about. It's about April. No, you don't want to go there. No, I want to end this. Bernie? Babe, are you okay? What happened? What are you doing here? Ethan, what did you do? Ethan! We talked about this. If you have a desire to drink, you call me or your sponsor first thing. Go on, babe. We had a pack. We tell each other everything. I know, baby. You want to tell her what's going on, Bernie? Hmm. I was just about to ask you the same question. I'm, I'm sorry, who are you? Why don't you tell me who you are? Since you have your hands all over my husband. I, uh... Say something! Bernie? Oh, mm, mm, mm. oh my gosh! Ultrasound, tell the OR he's coming up. BP's dropping, 92 over 66. Heart rate's up to 130. How you doing, Em? Can't even imagine how you must be feeling. Here I was wondering if he was marriage material. Guess we answered that question. I wish you didn't have to find out this way. But at least now you can make plans for your baby and your life without Bernie. I'm not leaving Bernie. He's the father of my child, Ethan. I have to make this work. But he lied to you. And so did you. I'm pretty sure I didn't need to fill out all those forms today. You orchestrated this huge public confrontation, humiliating me, jeopardizing Bernie's health. No, I was trying to protect you. Yeah, I don't know. I think you're just trying to rub my nose in it. Hey, that's not why he did it. He's had your back this whole time, Emily. You gotta know that. <sighs> I, don't know. Uh, I thought you were coming home tomorrow. I shipped out early. I wanted to surprise you. <gasps> <laughs> Mission accomplished. Maybe I, uh, I didn't, I didn't like how we left things. I've been thinking about it a lot over the last six weeks. Me too. So, um, you and I, we've been working so hard and trying to start a family, and I think I got caught up in planning that I forgot what the objective of the mission really was. It, I'm sorry, I didn't want to make it sound like a briefing. I love you, and I love your passion and your loyalty. And I don't want to go another six weeks without you in my life. So. April Sexton, will you marry me? I got tested, and I don't think I can have kids. I'm sorry. Baby, no. No, I'm sorry, but hey, that's OK. Look, I love you no matter what. OK, we'll figure this out together. I love you so much. So much. So sad, yes. Thank you. <laughs> I just wanted to make up for. You have nothing to make up for. Crack it. Okay. The night that you left on deployment. Nothing to do with Nothing. it. Nothing? Nothing to do with it? Ethan. You know what this is about. It's about April. No, you don't want to go there. No, I want to end this. So what's it going to take? You need to hit me. That it. Huh, big man? Go on. Take your best shot. Really? You hit him? It was so easy for me to see Crockett as the problem. Because the real problem was always right here. Between us. April, whatever it is you want. It isn't real. Ethan, that's not true. What do you. 
Where are you going? What are the bags for? I'm gonna find a hotel. No! Ethan, stop! Listen! Just, just take as long as you need to find a new place. What's Ethan? There's a ninja kid inside. We have to get in there. SWAT's on route. The girl said the boy's been shot. I hear you, but I got orders to stand down, hold the perimeter. Don't shoot, Medic! Don't shoot! Hold, hold, your, hold your fire! Hold your medic! fire! Medic! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Hey! I'm unarmed! I'm a doctor! I'm coming in! Don't shoot! Hey, don't move! Take it easy. I just want to help the boy. Hey, turn around, man. Turn around, slowly, or I will shoot you. Get on your knees. Come on. Just take it easy. Get down. I'm gonna make the demands, okay? Hey, look. You trying to kill me? Wait, 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 it's for the kid. It's for, for the kid. kid. Drop it. I can't. All right, he can barely breathe. He's got a collapsed lung. I need to make a hole in his chest to release the air that's trapped inside. Keep the gun pointed at me. Now I'm going to take this knife over to the boy now, all right? I'm gonna make a small incision in his chest. I'm gonna throw the knife away where I can't reach it. He needs more medical attention than I can give him, so call him back. Okay. I'll turn myself in. Hey, come on. Good one is making an announcement. As you all know, Dr. Lanik has stepped down as interim chief of the ED, and after careful consideration, the board and I have come to a decision on his replacement. So I am proud to announce your new chief is Dr. Ethan Choi. Ah, here he comes, the new chief. Couldn't happen to a nicer guy. That's Sam. Seriously. Congratulations, man. Well deserved. Thanks, we appreciate that. <laughs>